What's going on everybody? Lucas Parsons here with LGS Outdoors with another weekly fishing report from Fairmont, Minnesota. We got some rain this week. We got some wind today, which has really put a nice little chop on the water. Uh, hopefully going to fire these fish up. Uh, definitely been a good bite the last week, but uh, it's only going to get better from here. So stay tuned everybody. Well, these drum are always a lot of fun. <laughs> nice one. Put one in the box. All right, guys, you can see this rain got that water temp down a little bit, and now it's got these fish to be schooled back up again. Kind of been seeing this all over, big old groups of them again, still kind of getting them off the bottom. Today they're kind of preferring the worm more than the minnow, but uh, either way you can catch them. Like I said, it's bouncing in that 13, 13 foot range is kind of where I'm at right now. I've been seeing them from 15 to 13 foot grouped up like this. But that's what we got going on. Another Sunday fun day. So much fun. Put up a heck of a fight. What a bite we got going on right now. Crazy. Yeah, it takes talent to catch these small ones. <laughs> Still fun. And you'd be surprised at the amount of meat that comes off of this thing. Oh, these big ones are a lot of fun. What a fish this is. Wow, what a fish. Once again, Pilkey, that middle head, over the side, getting it done. I swear sometimes with this drop shot, you're a little late on the hook set and you get some of the weirdest hookups. Felt like I had a giant on there. As you can see, drop shot still, but uh, right now the worm's the ticket. That's what they're liking. Nice fish. Another nice fish. Boy, it's been wild right now. It's been pretty much every drop just jigging over the side. I actually switched to the pill key and a minnow right now. Just been kind of pinching the minnow and using the just the head and the body. And been catching lots and lots of these babies right here. Wow, what a bite we got going on. That is a big old stud yellow bass right there. Wow, what a fish. And he's going to taste good. Well, they're not always all giants, but this fish right here, a little five inch fish, he gets a nice fillet off of this thing. I'm telling you, if you haven't tried filleting them, even when they're small like this, it's worth your time. Call them uh, yellow bass fish fries. Well, there you have it. Last fish of the day. Drum. 13 foot of water, like I said, 15 to 13 foot. You can see on the bottom those fish and the fish out there. Like I said, they were schooled up pretty good today, so the rain's Definitely helped us out. Water temp is only 66 here. I had 67, so it dropped the water temp as well. So, can't beat it. It's been a great day. So, this is what we've been doing here. I said I got the gold pill key. And I'm just kind of putting the minnow head on there and then pinching the body off. And then once that's gone, then use the rest of the minnow. But that's been the ticket to catch more fish. Hey right, guys, we just finished up our day here at uh, Fairmont, Minnesota, and uh, it was a pretty good uh, few hours of fishing, I'd say. Bite's been good. Fish are definitely good size, good eating. Got some drum in there. I think we got six drum today, so that was fun. Definitely. F but uh, it's kind of some of the same, but this time I was using just a pill key with a drop chain on there with a minnow. It's breaking the minnow. Using just the head and the tail, that way, you know, they couldn't short bite you. Have better, better hookup, better connections there doing it that way. But uh, didn't do much for casting, once again, just jigging over the side of the boat. But man, I tell you what, if you want to come out here and catch some fish, it's going to be going to be epic. It just keeps getting better. Don't figure it could get any better, but it does keep getting better. And we're going to get more rain this week. It's going to cool down the uh, water temps even more, and these fish are going to be coming into shore, getting ready to be on the chew. But uh, that's what we got going on in Fairmont, Minnesota. We appreciate you watching. We'll see you on the next one.